Hello and welcome to the Hallman Online Training Academy. In this video we'll be demonstrating the basic setup for the Hallman WA400 460R control panel. These instructions also cover the 445R for both single and three phase. If this is the first time this door is being commissioned then please ensure all installation is complete for both electrical and mechanical components. First, use the manual override to raise the door off the floor. This control panel looks for additional safety devices that should be fitted on certain doors. On roller shutters under 2.5 metres high and on all roller grills, additional high level safety devices must be fitted. On this door, we have a high level optical safety device fitted to prevent drawing. If it's not required, the blue link in the control panel must be cut with the power off. We turn the power on and the display should show a U with a single line. If the display shows a U and two lines, please check the six core comms cable between socket X40 and the motor. Next, we move on to programming. Inside the control box, we have a round recess with the programming button in it. Press and hold for three seconds and the display will change to zero, zero. We go up to zero, one and press the stop. The display will change to an L with two lines. Press both the open and close together. Next we set the motor orientation, two equal signs and the display will then ask you to set the top limit. Briefly press the open button to make sure the door runs in the right direction. If the door closes, isolate the door and change incoming phases L1 and L2, not the supply coming from the control panel to the motor. Use the up arrow, drive the door to the top limit. And release. Press the stop to save the position. The control panel will then ask you to set the safety cutoff point. We then close the door to 35 millimeters from the floor. In this mode, the door can be open and closed. Press the stop to save the position. Finally, set the close limit. The display will change to 01. Press and hold the programming button to disable all the information changes. If you leave the control panel in programming for more than 30 seconds, the control panel will time out and any changes will be lost. From factory setting, this control panel works in dead man open and dead man close. To change it to auto open and auto close, we go back into programming. Using the up arrow to go to 05, press the stop and set the flashing 00 to 01. This changes it from dead man open to auto open. We then go up to program 11, press the stop and set the flashing 00 to 03. Press the stop and come out of programming. Program 11 changes the control so when the door's closing, the safe edge will perform a short reverse. At this point, we can move to menu 12. If the blue link is cut, we have access to it. Factory set looking for the high level safety device. It can be changed to either a low level safety photo cell or turned off completely. Please check the legislation regarding this equipment. If in doubt, please call us. When changing programs, press and hold the programming button to save all the information. If you leave the control panel for more than 30 seconds, it will time out and all changes to any information will be lost. Finally, we can perform our test run.
We can check our safety devices in both the open and closed direction. Fine adjustments can be made to the limits on this door. Menu 03 for the top limit and 04 for the bottom limit. If no fine adjustments need to be made, then the setup is complete. Thank you for watching this presentation.